Dark Jedi Jackson back. Last we left off, my character was taking his first steps towards the dark side. Let's continue to see where it goes. When you defeated the Legion Horde, you earned some spirits as a reward. You can use them to upgrade your power's effects or for items to use in your other world treks. Ooh, upgrade. Speak to me should you ever seek to spend your spirits. Crafting pit is basically. You get the. Spend your spirit to craft items. It's nice to have curing agents, I guess. How much spirit to have? 82? Fuck it, let's just use it all. Probably a bad sign, but I'm doing it anyway. Doing it! I'm still going mad. The chaos never ends, does it? Oh, right. I haven't introduced myself yet. My name is Nozomi Hinata. I'm a third year here at the Academy. Nice Ooh. to properly meet you. Upperclassman. Thank you for your help in the other world. You're the reason we were able to make it back safely. Are we done talking? That's it? You don't want to touch me? Okay, okay, all right. Well, maybe next time. Missing out, girl. Oh, there you are. Hey, um... You wanna get freaky with me. It's okay, I won't tell. If you're going to travel through the mist and fight the Pact Bearers, would you mind if I came along? But you're a scrub. I can't fight like you do. But I might be able to help in some other way. Ha <laughs> ha! Yes, now you're talking. Let's see what that mouth do. I just don't want you to carry this burden all on your own. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You stress reliever, I got it. Oh, I'm accepting the offer, yes. Thank you. The mist is spreading upward through the second floor of the building. can't reach up to me, so I don't know what that says. Why don't we head to the infirmary first? We should explain things to Chio and Dr. Kakeru. Ah, apparently that means infirmary. Got it. Oh, you're my companion. A.K.A. Concubine. Nice. Thank you, game. Control your character to progress through the story. Duh. The current location is displayed in the minimap. Duh. The next objective is in the bottom. Okay. Press triangle to bring up your smartphone. View objectives in the smartphone to do this. Okay, you can instantly move to previously visited locations. Or to the next miss. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. This feature may be temporarily disabled during a certain story time. Head to the infirmary. Okay. here ah you made it I was just talking things over with these two I'm sorry it's all my fault for answering that call shut up <laughs> you're annoying Chiyo, just like a kid I decided sister. I'm going to help your brother out oh okay I want to do whatever I can you're gonna eat my ass. Yeah. Thanks, Nozomi. I'll feel better knowing you're with him. Wow. Of course. And, uh, maybe there's something you can do too, Chio. Uh. I'm sure the newspaper club's ace reporter would be a great help in gathering intel. Okay. Woo. Oh. I never thought of 
of it that way. She thought she meant something too. Okay, sure. I'll give it my all. We both had our minds in dirty places. Oh, sis. Don't forget about your pal, the school doctor. You ever feel sick or hurt? Come pay me a visit. You're not a pal. You're you're an adult. Stop it. Thank you, everyone. You're being creepy again, I'll doctor. I'll support you to the best of my ability. I'm counting on all of you to work as a team. Support these nuts. A team? Exactly. Hmm. It's almost like we're in a club then. Maybe we should come up with oh a name. Oh my gosh. I'm in an anime. Sure. Why not? Sounds fun. Do I have to name it? Well, since Nozomi's part of the group, how about the True Student Council? Lame. What? That way, you'll get to be president again. Perfect. Means I can keep calling her Prez. Makes things easier for me. Wow, we are the lamest club on campus. Dr. Kakeru, would you please shut your mouth? A fitting name, if you ask me. At two, Miss Sora? Exactly, at two. My brother can be the vice president then. Uh, it's not like there are any other candidates. Wow, thanks, sis. Vice Prez, huh? Easy enough for me. You've got my vote. Oh my god. You just don't want to bother remembering anyone's names. It's settled then. You are hereby instated as president and vice president of the TSC. You have my approval as dean. But I'm the one that's badass. I should be president, but okay. Seriously? The current council was taken over by Mr. Hitotsubashi and his entourage. Many students wish you were still in charge. It isn't just Miss Aikawa and me. The other students believe in you as well, Miss Hinata. Very well. I accept the position. Let's put our best foot forward, Vice President. I didn't accept. I don't accept Glad the name. To see you're I don't accept the position. It. Now then, I have other matters I to attend all. to, so I'll be on my way. And the game ended prematurely because I killed them Okay all. then. Seeing as you two are already here, how's about I go ahead and get you checked up? Just want to touch my butt. That about covers it. Mental stabilizer. Interesting. Not much I can do about your amnesia, though, Vice Prez. All we can do is hope it's only temporary. Anyway, you're welcome to stop by any time. You got any health issues? I'm your man. You hear? down find a way to the main building okay I can't do half the stuff I want to anymore with this rickety old body so bored can't believe I've got too much time on my head yeah I'm leaving It's time. The student council meeting is about to start. Off to the student council room. Okay, zombie. So long as you follow my lead, your security is assured. Is that Karama's voice? It's coming from the student council room. We are living in unprecedented times. 
I speak not only of the barrier around the academy, nor the madness-inducing mist. Homicidal maniacs, epidemics, spontaneous combustion. Further oh, outlandish combustion. incidents plague the other building. I know you are all concerned about this inscrutable, hopeless situation. So long as you remain here, so long as you follow me, Kurama Hitotsubashi, you shall all be safe. This I swear on my life. On your life, huh? I ask for your continued support. Heed my words. Let us band together. We will make it out alive. Will we though? Hooray for President Hito Tsubashi. Hito Tsubashi. They sure are fired up in there. It's kind of scary, actually. Kurama's planning on locking this building down. True. It might be safer in here. But it won't solve anything. It's just ignoring the actual problem. I'm not so sure it's the right call to make. Anyway, why don't we check upstairs before one of his student council lackeys gets in our way? Okay, let's. Damn it, cutscenes! Good day, Vice President of the True Student Council. Wait, we literally just made this. How do you know that? Or perhaps nice to meet you would be more appropriate. Sora tells me you've lost your memories. I am Yugo Jingu, the steward of this academy. I oversee the students' daily needs here at the Academy. If you encounter any trouble whatsoever, please do not hesitate to let me know. In any case, may fortune smile upon Yeah, 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 let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go! The Jingus have watched over this Academy for decades. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's already explained that. Let's go. Though if you ask me, the fact that Miss Sora still looks so young is almost demonic in itself. What's her secret? Mm-hmm, 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 yes. They're a magical family. I get it. I get it. I don't care. I get it. Should I help you? Egos. Interesting. Okay. So I'm just going to my phone. Oh my, come on. So I go to their profiles. Oh my god, there's 106 of them? Uh, Alright, so let's do... Here's a baseball club, dude. Let's 
this guy? Yep, okay. That doesn't help me at all. All I know is I need to go to the third, third building, but uh, yeah, that's not gonna help me to like later on the game, which is probably not a demo. Should I even talk to this person? Don't go any further. It's troublesome. Nevertheless, please rest assured that To the miss. Fuck it. Three, two, one. I'm not supposed to go. But who's gonna stop me? For I am the protagonist. <sighs> Bitch, don't breathe that in. All right. Shall we get started? Yeah. Mist and Mad. While in the mist, the Mad Gauge will increase over time. If the protagonist's Mad Gauge hits 100, he will go mad. And you will restart from the infirmary. The Mad Gauge can be lowered at the infirmary or by using a mental stabilizer. Watch your Mad Gauge carefully as you search for the reception zones where calls that lead to ideals can be received. Okay. As you search for six and four calls, that lead to my deals. Alright, so. Get a call. What the hell is this? E, e, e. Venitas? I thought you weren't supposed to appear around other students. It's fine where mist is to be had. The students here have all gone mad. I'll watch from here, but don't feel strained. Just try to keep me entertained. Damn you, Mr. Ramalot. Now hold on. Okay. Stop going up. Ooh. Interesting, I feel like that's supposed to be important. Wasting time in a miss. Oh, lots of stuff to read and write and do stuff. something I have okay. to study harder I have to be number one I feel like we should be helping this guy is he holding up my phone can I help this guy can I do anything for this guy are you just Up. Can't help you, sorry. No, it's the Just go mad, I guess. We're exploring and going mad. Is this place I just came from? Nope. Different place. for me. I don't know what it means. I get it. You're trapped in the mist.
See that person talking to the cleaning supply locker over there? Hey, mm -hmm. Miu. What'd you get on the English test? It's not fair if I'm the only one who failed again. She's what we call unsettled. There are others like her running around in the mist. The mist messes with their heads, so there's no way to know how they'll behave. We need to keep going, but be careful, okay? I need to be careful. I'll jack her up. What? What are you talking about? I get it. The mist has sent you both off the rails, hasn't it? Uh-oh. Don't talk to me, you unsettled freaks. Uh-oh. Sounds like she thinks that locker is Miu. I wonder where the real Miu is. What would you ever do without me? So I gotta find a real one? Oh, luckily she's right here. Take your seat. It's almost time for class. I guess it's not her. Good morning. Good morning. Nice weather today, huh? Okay, everybody's in my way. Move on my way, thanks. Getting these morning. notes. I'm assuming that means something. If I find the person you are looking for, she's not hiding in the corner. Can't find your friend. Hmm. All right, let's just go downstairs. Maybe she's downstairs. What are you doing, man? Just heal me, come on. Yo! Prez! Vice- Glad to hear it. What? Do you think every boy and girl who hang out together are dating? Pretty much, yeah. you're old, Dr. Kakeru. Get off my back. I'm still in my early 30s. 
Are you? Your cluttered desk looks more like a toddler. That's not very nice. <laughs> oh. That wasn't a compliment. Why are we having a Ugh, this talk conversation? I just want to get healed. Haven't you heard the saying, out of sight, out of mind? That's not even how that idiot... Incidentally, Vice President, did you know Dr. Kakeru's wrist... Yep, it's been 11.45 p.m. for the past 10 years. A phone's good enough for telling time these days. People only ever wear watches for fashion now. True. What are you so proud of? In what world is a beat up old? <laughs> Come on, just heal Your me. Slacker attitude makes some people worry about the quality of care. I don't care about this banter. Well, that's rude of them. I know how to be in the right place. I just want to get healed and look for this chick. needs doing. I'm gonna do it right. Uh oh. Who's getting done? That was definitely a innuendo. Okay, you can't just hit on madness, bro. You seem kind of pale. Kind of pale because I'm good a white to guy. Go. Here's some medicine. Don't push yourself too hard. Thanks for the medicine. So I'll have to come back here less. Appreciate you. Is this just not the girl? What's in here? What's in here? What's in here? Oh, it's back in there for me. Can't go there yet. Alright. Oh, that's the bathroom. Can't go there yet. I'm running, damn it. This game is interesting. cool and all but that doesn't help us find this little girl so I guess I'm going back upstairs she's not down here who was downstairs nope roam around the miss all right can I just whip her ass because obviously Her hand. Oh, okay. When did that happen? And what's with this locker? It smells awful. Oh, so logic helps. Only in games, not in real life. Mew? Where are you, Mew? I promised I wouldn't let go. I was supposed to protect you. I'm sorry. Ah. 
I guess that means we can keep going. Yeah. Hmm. It's just like Reina said. This locker does smell awful. It's fighting time. It's more for time. Triceratops. What is that? Even the ringtone is creeping me out. A portal to the other world, a trace of the abyss. That call is what connects to the ideals, little miss. Stop rhyming. This abuse is becoming mundane. I can't even muster the words to complain. Let's just get to the fighting. What's wrong, dear Nozomi? Demon got your tongue? Don't make me tired. Why what? Why do you keep doing that? Nowhere. If you jump scare me one more time, I'm gonna lose it. The mist, the other world. I've been hanging on by a thread this entire time, and now my cover's totally blown. C calm down, okay? I'll apologize then. I won't just show up out of nowhere again. After this, my appearances will all be announced. All right? Apology accepted. Well, VP, come keep your companion under control. Let me smack her. Just forget it. Oh my God. Get it. You heard me. Pretend you never saw anything. Forget everything that just happened. Please. Including my promise not to surprise you? <laughs> nice. Everything except for that. I've never been good with anything scary. People would call me childish and pathetic. I've been trying to hide that part of me from you. The mist was scary enough with just the two of us. But when Vanitas popped out of nowhere, I just... I'm astonished you actually asked to attend. It's not like I want to be here. But I can't let the vice president put himself in danger all on his own. Oh my god. I wouldn't be able to live with myself. <laughs> deranged is as deranged does. Right? We've wandered off topic with that little spiel. As I said, that call connects to an ideal. Get close enough and you'll pick it up too. Just make sure you're fully prepared when you do. And don't forget to keep those eyes dry. Will you shut up already? <laughs> the house mm, crystal meth so that's an ideal it's beautiful in a creepy kind of way I feel like I'm getting cursed just looking at it The sooner we shatter it, the sooner we can go back. Let's go. 
It's technically the ideal of desire. Add reason and will for a trio entire. Gang, for a demo, you make me do a lot of talking. If voiding the pact is your goal, they're the key. But it won't be so simple to shatter all three. Oh gosh. A monarch would not let their plans go astray. They fiends of their own to keep you at bay. Monarchs, like humans, have much at stake. In the case their ideals shatter and break. What do you mean? Demons subsist off the human ego. That is the way they develop and grow. Ideals give humans the power they need, and demons the ego upon which they feed. Oh my gosh. Stop rhyming! Let's just get to it. If only I could fight too. Make a pack with a demon. You're already able to. For what do you protest? Huh? Imagic ears are nothing more than souls made manifest. The will to do so is all that you need. Though it isn't so easy as that, I'll concede. Terminal recall. Searching eight consciousnesses. Analyzing. Adapting. Linking. Decompressing Imagic Gear. End process. Upgrade. And you don't look as cool as I do, but that's cool. Ahem. All you really needed was my assistance. I'll save the explanations for a more obliging ear. I doubt you'd even grasp the weight of what I'm doing here. This is my power. The manifestation of my will. Um, I want that punani so. Um, thanks. But could you watch where you're staring, please? Oh gosh, whatever. Now enough with all this senseless prattle. Amuse me with your bloodlust in battle. Right? Oh my god. I have seen your unit cost spirit. Whoops! I used that already. Spend spirits, learn new skills. <sighs> spirit is shared amongst all members. Okay. Good placement. I like being awake, okay. Ooh, 
so I want to try to make somebody awake and mad at the same time. Here I go. Right, let's try to make this work. Alright, so my man, I'm gonna start off with some resonance. Resonate both of them. Resonate. Oh, whoops. I want to resonate. Here I go. That's okay. Just prefer to him. Vice President. No. I want you to defer to my other guy. Leave it to me. Okay. That's fine. Kill. Mother or father. Whatever. Enemy down. <laughs> How irritating. Nice. Get that back attack going. Okay, I like that. Here I go. Um, bitch, you might die. So I'm going to see you feel. I want you to feel yourself. Heal. I heal you. See, I knew she was gonna heal him instead of herself. Ah. Alright, here we go. I gotta get used to this. Ouch! 
back, sir. Here I go. I won't let anyone die. By your command. I mean, you might die. I could just kill him. But I'll let my ego wish, my lord. I am your lord. We made it, Nozomi. Good job. You were amazing. Follow your own star. Mm, yeah, I didn't take too long. You are right. Ooh, lust. Oh, because I said something about how she looked. Nice. Thank God my power came through there. Now you won't have to fight alone anymore. Whatever. You're still garbage. Even if that was terrifying beyond belief. Ideals, VP, are a fragile matter. The slightest touch will cause it to shatter. We are. They see hope on paths paved with despair. They hear it in words crafted from the same. Walking the road to ruin all the while. Only misery awaits at the end. It never changes. No matter how many times I tell them, or how many times they show. Humans truly are foolish. They are witless. Puerile and rash but if my hands can cover their eyes if my words can drown out their ears then at the very least no one would be hurt i could create a world free of destruction yeah you guys are heavy handed on a exposition at the beginning that's gonna be hard for people to get into the game. Where's that voice coming from? We're not getting haunted, are we? Shut up. Too much exposition. Don't get yourself all tied up. The ideal relayed you the pact bearer's thoughts. 
Oh, I see. That's a relief. Not that those thoughts were particularly pleasant, either. In any case, we should keep up the pace and shatter the other idea. And, uh... That means heading back sooner rather than later. Please? Why'd you agree to come if you just want to go back? I swear to God. You are annoying. Oh, we cleared some mist. Okay, so let's see how this game's gonna play. It's interesting enough. I'm ready to call it. Hey, hope you don't mind me stopping by. We got the gist of the game. Um, I think it'll be interesting. I think it'll be a long-winded game, a lot of exposition time. We'll leave players just kind of like, uh, bored. I mean, obviously it's a role-playing game, but you want to mix up action and an exposition. Action and the exposition, not just talk, 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 talk. I get to play for 30 seconds, then talk, 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 talk. So that's going to be a little critique of the game. Um, but I do find the game interesting, and I, I would play a game like this, but I don't think most people would. That's just my opinion. Alright, that's from Dr. Dark Jedi Jackson, and uh, I'm out. Peace.